California apostille process. My name is Rufus. I'm the notary dude here in uh, Los Angeles, California. I process a lot of apostilles. I also do a lot of uh, general notary work. Listen, I just had a phone call from a gentleman from Irvine, California, and he called and said that he has a power of attorney form that needs to be notarized and apostilled for India. And in the process, I'd like to ask a lot of questions just to kind of understand exactly what's going on. First of all, if you're in a situation where you need to get some forms notarized and apostilled, the number one, <coughs> excuse me, most important thing is you find a notary public who knows what the heck they're doing. Because a normal notarization, a lot of times, if it's done correctly or not, no one's really going to need, is going to know if it's correct or not until you have to execute it. For example, a power of attorney form, you might get it notarized, you think, oh, everything is correct, but when you actually go to execute that power of attorney form, if it wasn't notarized correctly, you're gonna have some problems. So the first thing is you need to find a notary public who's highly rated, is experienced, and knows exactly what they're doing. So I explained that to him. I'm in Monterey Park, he's in Irvine. It's a little distance away. I don't wanna drive all the way to Irvine to do it. Um, I told him if he wants to come out here to get it done, he can. The problem is his mom, who needs to sign that power of attorney form, is like 85 years old. So obviously that's gonna be difficult for her to drive a couple hours. So anyway, long story short, if you need to get a document notarized and apostilled, number one most important thing is you go with a notary who knows what they're doing. After speaking with him more, come to find out that they're looking to sell a property in India. And before they're gonna let them sell that property in India, the India government also wants other documentation notarized and apostilled, like, uh, passport, driver's license, some bank records. Um, there's, he said there's like eight or nine different forms that he needs to have notarized and apostilled. And he just asked me, he said, Rufus, how difficult is it to get the apostille? You know, getting the apostille for California and other states for that fact, it's not that difficult to do. The biggest obstacle you're gonna have is making sure the documents we have you have are notarized correctly. One thing you need to know about an apostille is that Secretary of State could care less for the most part what the document is. All they're gonna do is turn to the notarization and make sure that document is notarized correctly. So he's gonna to come to me next week. We're gonna get everything to, uh, notarized. I'm gonna take it to the Secretary of State to get the apostille done. Look, if you're in a situation where you need to get an apostille done, especially in California, you need guidance, call me. My phone number is below. I'm the notary dude here in Los Angeles, California. I also have Bulldog Notary and Apostille in Monterey Park. So call me. I'm happy to help any way I can.